happy Thursday. Welcome to your pressure break. I thought we would do two things today. First, happy new year. This is the first one of this year. And in light of everything that's going on, I thought I'd remind us of a verse in Hebrews 12, 28 that says this. It says, we're getting a kingdom. We're welcoming in a kingdom that is unshakable. Therefore, we should be thankful we should worship with respect and awe our God. Of course, that's the Larry Underwood paraphrase. Um, I'll put it up in the NIV so you can actually read it. But it's a perfect time for us to focus on certain things that are very, very important. Uh, for our everyday lives. And one of those, in my opinion, is family. With that said, I'm going to walk you around the church a little bit and talk about something that's fairly exciting, at least for me. It's a brand new family event. I'm walking down the stairs, so I'll try to be careful. Um, a family event that we're going to start doing once every month. The first one's going to be on January 31st. Essentially, your family comes to church, but they show up to church as a family. And what they do is they enjoy some teaching, some music, some crafts, some foods, and they have dinner together as a family. So as I, I enter uh, what we refer to as the fellowship hall or the activities center, uh, we're going to just look around really quick. You can kind of look behind me and see that we're going to be transforming this space even further into a, a center for worship and, and a center for families. Walking into our nursery, which as I kind of scan around, you can see we've done some work in here to remodel this, to make this a little bit more uh, family friendly. So let's head over to the Welcome Center and talk about this. So I'm here in the new Welcome Center, and essentially all I want to say about the 411 family gathering is this. Encourage your family to come. If you know somebody that has, you know, preschoolers, elementary uh, kids, uh, middle schoolers, high schoolers, uh, they should be attending church together as a family. That's what this event is designed to do. So we want to pass down faith and values from one generation to the next. We want uh, church to be more than just a, a gathering. We want to create something that equips parents, that equips families to navigate the times that we're in. Because ultimately, for a unshakable kingdom, which is what Jesus ushered in for us, in order for that to be incredibly successful, we are part of the solution. We're the hands, we're the feet, we're the ones that are called to action. There are so many things about our faith that are important. Private prayer, corporate prayer, small group life, Bible studies. But the real business of working out our faith by doing things like this is so incredibly important. It takes all of us to make this happen. So if you're watching and this isn't an event that you would attend, perhaps you will step in and help us out by serving. Just email me, Larry at Bradenton.church, and we'll get you plugged in. And remember, God's kingdom is unshakable. Don't focus on the world around us that we are separated from anyway. We're not conformed to anything that's going on around us. We are on mission to share the gospel, to share the love of Christ. Let's do that.